Teresa, I'm 20 years old. My name is Ruthie Nicole, and I'm a receptionist at Garrison Sports Centre. Hello, I'm Michael Zwara, Thames Valley resident. Thames Valley Housing have been very beneficial to get me back into the workplace and building my confidence. Thames Valley Housing is very beneficial for young people who want to get back into work. Thames Valley helped me out to get renew my passport, my council tax, working tax credit, and housing benefit. <laughs> On all the vehicles you have a boiling hot water dispenser. Please be careful, this is boiling hot water. This is turned on by the switch located here. Red light will come on. Informs you that the system is heating. When the system is ready, the light underneath will turn green, located here. If the system needs water added to it, a yellow light will appear on the top, saying add water. If you have a specialist vehicle, you turn on the pump, the switch for this is located on the bulkhead. If you're in a standard vehicle, you refill the system by undoing the cap and filling with water. Water is dispensed by pushing down on the red button. We are the Westgate. Bound by blazers where teachers are fair and students are individuals. We don't always see eye to eye on everything, like football teams and jewellery, but together we grow, becoming happy global citizens. We build empires and map the tributaries of the Amazon. We forge Picassos and create banquets. We are champion athletes and travel through time. That's just a normal Monday. We look beyond our walls. We teach possibilities, not limits. Achieving the unimaginable. We are the future. Will you join us? My experience of being an apprentice has been really, really good. I came straight from sixth form to do my apprenticeship. I thought the transferable skills going from sixth form to the apprenticeship was really good as well. Young people should consider the apprenticeships because but the apprenticeship is a nice little step in between where people sort of mother you a little bit and they make sure you're right, but they give you the independence to develop and bring out your own skills instead. Do you recognise this man? You may have seen someone like him before. Unkept, homeless or just drunk. Unfortunately he is none of these. He has dementia. Many people however with dementia do not display any of these signs. In fact there are 800,000 people living with dementia every day and many of these are undiagnosed. So what is dementia? Dementia is an umbrella term. It describes the symptoms that occur when the brain is affected by certain diseases or conditions. Of, of, of course, he, this, the bloody immigrants, they're still right under our nose. They should all be sent back. Yes, I'll be out in a sec, Beth. Over. Do you mind if I take a look at those documents? Sure. Mummy will show you. Go on, Mummy G. What 
the f is going on? Uh, Don't even think about it. Move. Move. Okay, okay, look, look, mister. Okay, we can work this out now. If you just put the gun down, please. He, he has got already. No, okay, just shut, shut up. Shut up. Okay, look, okay, what, what, what is it that you want? I just want to go home. Okay, okay, home, home. Where, where's home? Lodi, Punjab, India, just behind Sidhu's middle. Okay, okay, there's a procedure for that. I, I can help you. No, no, how? This bastard made me burn my passport. Okay, it's gonna take some time, I know, but it can I don't have time! And I'd rather die than go home without any money. I'm, look, I'm really sorry. I'm sorry, okay, I'm sorry. Let's see all the exits, we need assistance! Can you leave the tea, please? Tea solves everything. Well, it's not going to solve this problem. You're the problem. Don't get it, do you? How are we going to manage this? We can barely afford to feed ourselves. How are we going to feed it? I don't think I can go through with this, Adam. We just can't keep up with it all. How are we supposed to raise a child in these conditions? The story of Herschel Park is perhaps Slough's best kept secret. A secret maintained for roughly 170 years, since it was first built in the 1840s. This film will unearth the forgotten history of a once valued Slough treasure. To its redevelopments, crises and eventual decline. I first became aware of Upton Park when doing some work on the 1851 census, uh, which shows how special an area it was even at that stage. Although in disrepair over the past few years, the land including Herschel Park was once an ancient estate of the manor of Upton, with roots dating back to the Anglo-Saxon period. Show my true feelings, but I think I managed it. This? <laughs> oh, that's fantastic! I'm so glad you're happy too. I remember the first day we met in the office. It's safe to say that we had quite a bit of chemistry. 